Hey, what's going on, everybody? And welcome back to another video. So, today I think it's a pretty important video, at least in my opinion. If you're gonna be staying on Warframe for a while, it's knowing how to get stuff cheap. There is the trading chat in game, but it can be a little cancerous. Um, some people are trying to sell things for an, an absorbent amount of price. So, if the price looks sus, come to this website. The link is at the top, obviously. And it's not just for PC, PS4, Xbox, and Switch. So, but I'm on PC, so I'm going to leave it on PC. Obviously, the first thing you're going to want to do when you're on this website is make an account. Um, it'll have the process. You make your account, and then... Um, you can put your status if you want your invisible online in game or if you're online. But basically, if you're not on the site, you'll basically be offline. Once you sign in, you'll automatically be put online in game. You can switch that to just online if you're not in the game, which I'm not in the game right now, but it's fine, whatever. Now, let's just say we want to get, I don't know, Volt Prime. You'll type in Volt, and then you can see that they have the set, or if you just need a piece. So let's look at the set. Okay, so Volt Prime set. So this guy's selling one set for 350 That's fucking retarded. Scroll down, and then you'll see that the prices are starting to go down a lot lower. This guy has multiple for 150. That's pretty lit. 150 for Volt Prime is really good, but look, there's even cheaper. 120, 113. Let's see, you can get Volt Prime for 113. Now the thing is. You gotta you gotta check on Warframe Market for who's selling it. Sometimes they'll get offline. Sometimes they'll get back online. Like, look at this asshole. Five hundred. <laughs> Especially since Resurgence came out, like a lot of the vaulted relics came back into play. So, yeah. But do not get raped in prices. But then, now if you just do this. Let's just say, oh, I just need the systems, okay? So then here's the prices for the systems. And again, you'll have somebody that's trying to bamboozle. And then if you scroll down, though, it gets a lot cheaper. You could do this with any, like, um, let's see, Haro is the new one, right? So Haro Prime. So Haro Prime set. Again, there's this asshole trying to sell all of them for 350 It just came out. But, look, the price gets cheaper. Someone's selling a set for Haro Prime for 105 That's actually really good. And then again, if you just need a piece, you just put Haro Prime, and then you just click on one, and then see what piece you need. I don't know which piece, because I just, I bought the uh, the Prime Axis, so. But here's for the Neuroptics. Again, high price, just take your time and look. What the fuck? 115, you're bugging. But... See, like, 35. Okay. Now, I'm going to show you guys a trick to getting cheap ribbons. So, if you're on here, because some people in the trading chat in the game are asking autistic prices. Click here for contracts, right? And I kept telling you guys about getting a Cernos Prime, so... 
But I mean, it's whatever. Let's see if we can find. Got this. Oh, I'm just type it. Cernos. Okay. So you'll type in the weapon name, leave everything else the same. Now, here we go. So usually at the top, they're going to show things that are still in auction. See, like this one's in auction right now. So they're not bidding for it. I mean, it's you can get a way better roll than that. Why do you need magazine capacity? <laughs> it's a bow. So he's bugging. But see, like the buyout price is the infinity sign. You don't want this. So what? How is that five thousand? Crit damage, multi shot, and damage. I wouldn't. I wouldn't even pay that much. That's retarded. <laughs> now, one seventy eight crit chance, one hundred six multi shot. See, this is yeah, but then you had uh, negative to damage to corpus. I still wouldn't even pay three thousand for that. You gotta remember, like three thousand dollars, three thousand plat, right? If you do the math, you're like paying maybe sixty-five to seventy dollars worth of plat. Even if if you've been selling stuff and just fucking hustling, then that's cool and all. But just make sure that you're spending your plat wisely, especially if you're going to be staying in this game. You want to start buying a lot of forma. Like look at that one down there, two hundred crit chance. That's not bad. Oh, that one's really good. <laughs> See, 200 crit chance, 157 crit damage, and then more fire rate, and then minus status chance. Yeah, like status chance, eh, who cares? But that's pretty good if you're going to make a crit build out of it. Sheesh. That's actually really good. But anyways, um, I'm losing track. So if you want to get it really cheap, right, keep scrolling scrolling and then you, you can start to see yo 220 crit chance 291 damage for 200 plat all righty but keep going down the prices start getting cheaper look at 160 110 because there's going to be people that don't know what to put the price for it. So they just want to get rid of the ribbon. But you, you keep going down. And then it gets cheaper and cheaper. Like a 90. 75. 50. 44. Look at that. 40. 40, 30, 30 plat. And then, of course, you can just roll it yourself. So that way, I mean, yeah, rolling sucks, but it's better than painting in a, you know, a obnoxious price for a ribbon. So that's one way to do it. So you'll just click here and then pick the weapon that you're looking for and then just keep scrolling. I mean, if you're satisfied with the role it has and you want to pay, honestly, for... Because this, this weapon has a Dispo of 4. So a Dispo of 4, myself, I would probably pay up to maybe like 650, 700 plat. If it's a really nasty role. There's people that are putting like Dispo of 2 or Dispo of 1 for like... 1.5k or 3,000, like, that's fucking retarded. That's not even going to boost up your weapon that much. I mean, the galvanized mods are doing way more than that. So. If it's a dispo of 3 or higher. That's when you can start to, like, be like, okay. If it's really good, I'll put some plan into it. 
if it's a dispo of one or a dispo of two, do not be that guy and pay a stupid price for something. I, I swear to God. Like um like bubonical ribbons. They're like some some are selling for like eight hundred or higher. Like you don't need that. The bubonical's a monster on its own. It's a waste of money. But anyways. That's pretty much it. I mean you can look for mods too on this. So I'm trying to think of one that's Blaze. So Okay. Again, there's gonna be people that do that. Blaze is one a hard mod to get. It's 60 damage, 60 heat for shotguns. It drops only on nightmare missions, but you can see like it went from 200 down to like 65. I bought mine for 50. Now, if you're not liking the prices you're seeing, even on here, like like so like let's say like you know like this is like the cheapest one, 64. Go to in game, and then in the trading chat. But willing to buy, so the WTB, and then do the uh, the brackets, Blaze, PMO, and then see if somebody will just give you a cheaper offer. That's another way to do it. But anyways, hopefully like you guys found this enlightening. Um, pretty much, like, if you want something, I would come here first. And then see what people are selling it for. And then if you like it, all you do is click, click buy. You'll copy it. If you're on PC, you can just copy it and then you just um, control V into chat and then it'll send the whisper straight to them. Um, for these, it'll have steps on what to do. I mean, basically, you're just going to have to type it in the chat yourself. But too easy. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you guys next time.